Here there are 400 Japanese cherry trees and every single one of these has a women name. My name is Rocco from Romantic Tour Amsterdam and we are here in a Japanese cherry forest. 400 trees. This was a gift from the Japanese community, the women's club in Amstelveen, which is very close by here and close to Amsterdam. And these gave them as a gift to Amsterdam when, uh, to celebrate the 400 years of you know, partnership, cooperation with the Dutch. Every single one of these trees has a name, a female name. 200 trees have a Japanese female name and 200 trees have a Dutch female name. And they gave them to thank the Dutch. The Dutch, yes, for their hospitality. Because here in Amstelveen, there, are, there is the biggest Japanese community, but also uh, the second biggest one in Europe. Now, Japanese cherry tree is the national tree. And they have a ritual in Japan. In early spring, they come together here and gather and celebrate the start of a new beginning, the spring. These cherry trees represent impermanence. Everything goes by. And what they do is they come here with their loved ones and share a picnic or enjoy the lovely trees that they see all around. This is a beautiful tradition and the blossoming of the trees is called Sakura. All around Amsterdam there are people yes, that come and blossom and enjoy the blossoming of these trees. Now, now also in Amsterdam you can. So if you are here in end of March, April, depending on the season, for just a few weeks, yes, just a few weeks, this also refers back to the impermanence, yes, you can see this blossoming. Enjoy the beauty of a new beginning and of the beautiful Japanese cherry trees when you are here in Amsterdam. Now there is a legend of a tree that did not want to blossom. And this I share with you on a podcast which relates to the cherry trees. So down below here you can find that uh, podcast and I hope you enjoy it. Have a lovely time and this was Rocco from Romantic Tour Amsterdam.